dressing them up. <laughs> Lori Wallace headed over to uh, McCollum Hill to learn more. This is the best. Hey, Lori. You guys, up until a few hours ago, I didn't even know that you could get bows for your chickens. <laughs> but it's a thing. People love their chickens. We've done a lot of stories so on Good Day with people in their own chicken coops, building their own little coops in their backyard. Well, she'll be out here up in the mountains. McCallamy Hill yeah. has her own chicken coop and her own chickens that you've done a lot of interesting things with. So we talked to you last hour. We saw some of the chickens. They're all brightly colored. How do you, I know people at home might be wondering, how do you color them? How do you get these clothes on them? They're chickens. They actually let yeah. you dress them. How does this whole thing work? Honestly, you have to get a silky. They're the absolute best ones to play around with, dress up with. Um, as far as uh, coloring them, I use pet friendly things and um, I make all their clothes. And Chanel is honestly the only one that will let me dress her up. She absolutely loves it. We do spa day, I paint her toenails. Can we look, yeah. get, let's get a look yeah. at the nails because the nails are done. And if you're wondering why Chanel is in the Barbie car, well, this is just one of the. Oh, here we go. Let's see. Let's see the toes. I'm sorry. Okay, here we go. She's like, Mom. I know. I'm let's sorry. see. All right. Okay. There you go. To match. To match her. They're pink. Everything's pink. Take note. <laughs> everything's pink. But you set up these little photo shoots yes. for the chickens. Yes. So the name of your business is Tickled Pink Pet Accessories. Tickled Pink Pet Accessories. Mm -hmm. Not just for chickens, but that's the focus right now. So mm -hmm. you take a lot of photos and set up photo shoots yes. of these guys. Yes. And this is just some of your props. It's just some of my props. Um, uh, honestly. <laughs> They're all over the place right now. We have everything I have from, you know, fish tanks to... And it looks like mostly Barbie stuff. Yeah, it's all Barbie stuff. Thank God for Barbie, right? She's our role model. So what is the goal for this? Because I know you've been doing this for a while with the pet accessories, but what is your goal with the chickens? My goal is to brighten up someone's day. I want to do something different with this. I don't want to just make pet accessories. I want to be able to take them places go to people, nursing homes, people that are sick, depressed, anxiety. I have PTSD and I love the fact that this chicken can do different things other than just walk around my yard and on and I was going to tell you about the pooping. I know people are going to ask me about the poop. <laughs> tell me about the pooping. The pooping, <laughs> it, it, they poop. Everybody poops, right? But um, we have diapers that we make and they poop inside of diapers. Yeah, so, so you can take them more places. Yes, I take her everywhere in her diaper. And uh, we also make these little chicken charms oh. right here. They're okay, little so that's the other thing. A lot of things are blinged out. Yes, that's our. Fo that's my main focus. It's called Tickled Pink Pet Accessories. Okay, so you can find me on Facebook. Yes, you can find me on Facebook, Etsy, Instagram, but um, we're mostly on Facebook. Okay. We do a lot of connecting through Facebook. Tickled Pink Pet Accessories. You'll find pictures of Chanel and the rest of the chickens in the coop. They may not be dressed up, they may not like it, but Chanel will always be looking her finest blinged yes. out out here on the farm. I'll send it back to you guys. Oh my goodness. Now I want a silky. I need to get a silky chicken. This is the best thing ever.